In this question, we are given a train travels a distance of 480 km at a uniform speed. Here we are given two things. The distance is 480 km and the speed of the train is uniform. If the speed had been 8 km per hour less, then it would have taken 3 hours more to cover the same distance. We need to find the speed of the train. So let us assume the speed of the train be x km per hour. Then the time taken to cover distance of 480 km would be distance over speed that is 480 by x hours. Secondly we are given if the speed had been 8 km per hour less that is if the speed be x minus 8 km per hour then obviously the time taken to cover would be distance that is 480 km divided by speed that is x minus 8 km per hour. Obviously the second time would be more because the speed is less and difference between these two times is given to be 3 hours. So the difference of two times that is 480 over x minus 8 minus 480 over x is equal to 3. Now multiplying by the LCM that is product of denominators x minus 8 times x all the terms of this equation and then cancelling out like factors we get 480x minus 480 times x minus 8 is equal to 3 times x minus 8 times x. Distributing this gives 480x minus 480x plus 3840 is equal to distributing 3x square minus 24x. Collecting all terms on one side, we get 3x square minus 24x minus 3840 is equal to 0. Now comparing with the standard quadratic equation, we get a is equal to 3, b is equal to minus 24, remember to take always sign also and c is equal to minus 3840. Now substituting in the quadratic formula, we get x is equal to minus b that is minus 24 plus or minus under root minus 24 whole square minus 4 times a that is 3 times c that is minus 3840 divided by 2 times a that is 3. Simplifying we get 24 plus or minus under root 24 square is 576 plus minus minus becomes a plus and the multiplication is 46080 is equal to 24 plus or minus square root 46656 over 6 and as a square root of 46656 is 216 we get 24 plus or minus 216 over 6 is equal to 24 plus 216 over 6 or 24 minus 216 by 6 that gives 240 by 6 or minus 192 bar 6 or 40 or minus 32. Since the speed cannot be negative, we discard the negative value 32. So the speed of the train is 40 km per hour. Our next question is descriptive and a bit lengthy. In this question we are given two water tapes together can fill a water tank in 9 and 3 over 8 hours. The tape of larger diameter takes 10 hours less than the smaller one to fill the tank separately. And we have to find the time in which each tape can separately fill the tank. So we are given both taps together fill the water tank in 9 and 3 over 8 hours. Simplifying gives 8 9 is 72 plus 3 75 over 8 hours. So one tank or the full tank is filled in 75 over 8 hours. So in one hour they will fill reciprocal of it that is 8 by 75th part of the tank. It is exactly like if a tank is filled in 2 hours then in one hour its reciprocal it is filled 1 over 2 only. Now we assume the larger diameter tape alone can fill the tank in x hours. So in one hour it will fill 1 upon x part of the tank. Similarly, 
A smaller diameter tip will fill the tank in x plus 10 hours because it is given in our question that it takes 10 hours more. So in one hour, the smaller diameter tip will fill 1 upon x plus 10th part of the tank. So in one hour, larger diameter tip fills 1 upon x part of the tank plus smaller diameter fills 1 upon x plus 10th part of the tank. And as per question, in one hour, they together fill 8 over 75. So we equate this to 8 over 75. Now taking LCM, we get x times x plus 10 in the denominator and 1 times x plus 10 plus 1 times x in the numerator is equal to 8 over 75. Now cross multiplying, we get 2x plus 10 times 75 is equal to 8 times x times x plus 10. Distributing, we get 150x plus 750 is equal to 8x square plus 80x. Now transferring and collecting terms, we get 8x square minus 70x minus 750 is equal to 0. At this stage, we have effectively translated our description into a quadratic equation. So what remains is to solve this quadratic equation for which we will use the quadratic formula. Here a is equal to 8, b is equal to minus 70 and c is equal to minus 750. Substituting in the formula we get x is equal to minus b that is minus 70 plus or minus under root b square that is minus 70 whole square minus 4 a means 8 c means minus 750 so we get 70 plus or minus 70 square is 4900 4 times 8 times 750 is 24000 and the sign changes as there are two negative signs in multiplication whole divided by 16 is equal to 70 plus or minus under root 28900 over 16 and the square root of 28900 is 170 first taking positive sign we get 240 by 16 then taking negative sign we get minus 100 over 16 that simplifies to 15 or minus 6 and a quarter since the time taken to fill the tank cannot be negative we discard the negative value so the larger diameter tape will take 15 hours to fill the tank and the smaller will take 10 hours extra that is 25 so answer is 15 and 25 respectively